not come to my face. Hi. Has it been three up? minutes yet? It's three minutes. Hey! hey. <laughs> <laughs> um, I love I this thing. I think, I think, oof. Um, wait, we, oh, this is like, Robocop. I'm a, I'm a super Pretty. woman. Oh yes, this is. Wait, what's the name? What's our superhero name? <laughs> you don't, I don't, I can't. LED I can't. woman. Okay, LED woman. Okay. LED women in full effect. You know what? What? Super, super delicious super, eye women. Yeah. Super, super, super eyes. I don't know. Ready to. Ready to conquer the world. Knock out those wrinkles out of your face. (laughs) This is this is what we do for beauty. This is what we do for beauty. Welcome back to another episode of After We Wrap. Um, we're so excited. Superhero edition. We're so excited. Um, if superhero edition, exactly. With we're if you couldn't tell, we're going to be talking about skincare today. But before we get started. Uh, we just want to remind everyone mm-hmm. to follow us and leave us a nice review. And all uh, the podcasts. Tell your of- mother, your father, your sister, your brother, your cousins, everybody. After we wrap show, here we go. Uh, Spotify, Google, YouTube, all your, all favorite, your favorite podcast platforms. Um, and then our Patreon. The after <gasps> party. Patreon. Where uh, everything just gets... The- you, you, you basically have a inside look inside. <laughs> on what goes on. This crazy show. Um, no, but uh, clearly today is um, skincare. It is. It's a skincare episode. This is our and we're wearing um, Dr. Dennis Gross. Hope we're pronouncing your name right. Um, it's the Eye Care Max Pro LED. It produces collagen. It, um, it helps with wrinkles and crow's feet and your 11s, you know, women. I mean, there's so much to talk about. It, there's there so much to talk so about. Much. This is so much fun. I, first of all, I love this thing. I've always wanted to get it. And now that we have it, I'm like, oh, this is my best friend every day for three minutes. I know. Hello. You can also get a meditation in mm -hmm. while you're at it. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, I just love, too, that it looks like a superhero mask. I can't can't get over it. It's very cute. I just, I love it. Yeah. Yeah, So you charge it. Yeah, you charge it. It Comes in a little cute package. Look at this. Comes in a little cute. uh, And it has its little own little bag, too, for traveling. You know, or you can put it in, in the little bag here. And here's a little charger. But oh Bam, my God, you thank go. you so much. Yeah. I'm so excited. Um, cheers. Cheers oh, to cheers. another episode. Cheers to. We are drinking a little cab. Ooh, Cabernet. Cabernet cheers. Sauvignon. And this, this glass, I mean, I mean Jana almost knocked I don't know. Uh, the wine glass this, like three times. But yeah, this that's one is we less dangerous. Glass. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I swear ASMR we're not drunk. We're not those who love to hear something. But I wanted to, I wanted to show you something, Jayma. What? Look at this cute little koozie. Oh my gosh, yes. From our wedding. Yes, 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 Look yes, at yes. Koozie. My cousin Sophia made Before, this. So adorable. I know. It's Shane and Gabby. It's our little, on a little beach mermaid in moment. Puerto Rico. And it has Prince your wedding Eric. date, 5 2023, <laughs> which is, uh, that's, that's a nice wedding date. It is. Um, I, but I before we get into skincare, we want to talk about wedding. Oh my gosh, yes. The Puerto Rican destination it wedding. Happened. Oh my God. And it was amazing. You know, they always said, I was told right before um, the we, the what wedding festivities started, a friend messaged me. She's like, you know, take everything in. And I want to let you know that 40% of things go wrong in weddings. And I was like, 40%? Man, that, that's high. But it's true. It's like, you know, it's not not that anything went wrong. Everything went perfectly the way it's supposed to be. Like five minutes before the ceremony or all the guests started arriving to the ceremony castle because we got married in a castle. (gasps) Fairy tale. Hi. (laughs) Um, It was raining. And then literally five minutes before everybody was like supposed to, you know, start getting seated. Yeah the sky opened up Uh, and it's just like it worked perfectly but they always say that rain brings you good luck right it is it does it does so i was but it was it was like torrential raining all day like i and but no i was i was so i was so um at ease i wasn't worried about anything i prayed a lot i did i prayed a lot 
or manifested, I guess. I manifested yes. that everything was going to be perfect. And it was. You know, there were little hiccups and I didn't get to do the speech. <laughs> I, my, my thank you speech was like, thank you so much for being here. <laughs> but that's and amazing. Like, and then I was like, damn, I forgot my speech. Because I was going to think, I was going to think, you know, my bridesmaids. My the heartlines, my family, my my bachelorette group, and it just became like an arroco, huh? Okay, mm. I'm gonna think them out because my thank you speech became like an arroz con habichuela, you know, like a rice and bean matchup. But my thank you, <laughs> <laughs> rice and bean. Matchup. But I mean, I did thank my family, my 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 familia, the OG, you know, my OGs, my Coyaso side, my Ortiz side. I for, I I wanted to give a, a shout out to my Tampa side, the Madisini, the Mints, the Pernas, the Bensons. Thank you so much for all your love and support throughout the years. And I know Nano was there with us that whole time, and he's there with us always. And uh, I did give a, ch- a shout out to my bachelorette group. Girl, we got 14 girls together on a cruise for my bachelorette weekend, and 14 friendships were born. I kid Aww. you not. It is insane. Like, I'll show you all the pictures. Like, these girls didn't know each other. They didn't know about each other. Wow. And you're on the chat, so you see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's on the, she, she sees everything. Oh my gosh. And amazing i like my friend um from college she's like oh yeah god and i are gonna go we're gonna go do this and i'm like oh so you're like best Hang friends out. now yeah. i was like what <laughs> it, it, it was so beautiful Aww. and and obviously the heart lines queen candy and 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 dad heartline i i feel like i gotta find king heartline i met mr Allen. and mrs heartline i know yeah king and queen of 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 lake wales like those two are like royalty i'm not i kid you not oh and and um uh, king i'm gonna call him king uh, king no king dad king i oh my god oh she will my be gosh amazing. cannot wait to have cannot candy wait. heartline but i mean and, and the name I, candy alone i know i know okay and one last shout out to my new sisters maddie and lexi i love you so much Thank you for accepting and loving me. Okay, and we're done because I'll just keep going. Oh, but, that's so but, cool, though. <laughs> but it was a party. It was a party. But we definitely go into skincare with this conversation yeah. because you looked absolutely stunning. Shout out to Derek Munoz, my makeup artist, hair and makeup. And he I was, mean, I mean, I told him, I was like, you're stuck with you me You looked forever. like a princess. Thank you. You seriously, you and Shane both looked so beautiful but also very ha- like happy as a as you know the bride and groom should mm. be on their wedding day i mean obviously it's just a lot of preparation to get everyone to a destination yeah. wedding yeah and so that alone is just whew, stress when we were, on top when of we were getting the text messages like oh we're here we're here i, I remember looking at she i was like they're starting to arrive and like both of us just went into panic mode we're like oh my god this is for real it was just like a we can't mess up everything has to go not yeah, per- you know we don't you don't want to put that pressure yeah. on yourself but it's just like you're, you're hoping that everything goes well Smoothly. and everybody yep. yeah no, nothing yep. bad happens you know right. and thankfully everything just went what a success divine so beautiful um and what did you so, do to prep so for it? yes so obviously i a, a lot of the led masks I have another mm-hmm. one too. Obsessed. Um, and I'm obsessed. Uh, and then here's the thing, Jane Ali Ortiz. <laughs> now I'm doing the Shane. <laughs> Shane loves to call her. What Gabby? Her full name. What Gabby Ortiz Heartline? <laughs> um, I am not that good at skincare. Like I, I'm good. I know the basics, but I know I can be better. Okay. So I just did like, you know, I, I had a chemical peel. I did like a, uh, uh, what's that? Laser? Uh, not oh, laser, the but the abrasion. abrasion. You know, I try to make sure that I had all of these like, uh, p- not procedures, but, but like, treatments. But treatments, yeah, treatments done, you know, ahead of time. So mm-hmm. I would give myself plenty of time if I had any blemishes, whatever. And, um, and then obviously a little help, you know, you know, we got a little yeah, help. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no judgment help, here. No judgment gotta do what you know. gotta do. Um, Shane wasn't super happy, but hey, hey, but he liked what he saw. He liked know, what he I saw. Know. <laughs> but um, and and but what was I saying? Okay, so I did a lot of that, and then obviously I tried not to drink throughout at least the last so two weeks. So hard not to. It's so hard not yeah. to because you're celebrating, but also the alcohol dehydrates the alcohol, your skin. Mm-hmm. I see a huge difference when I drink the next day. Yep. I am like a yep. raisin. Yep, yep. I get Ooh. swollen. Like I just yeah. Like, I yeah. bubble up and um Hydration so that's why I was trying to not drink too much once Thursday you know came in and I was like all right all we're right, done like it. nothing yep. plus it was so hot in Puerto Rico that you're sweating 
all the time. Oh, sexy. Gosh. And so like you're, you're detoxing and as you're drinking. And dancing. <laughs> you're detoxing as you're yeah, toxing yeah. yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Is that even a, even a word? Yeah. But wedding day. So funny story. I, we go to, because we have the rehearsal dinner um, and I hadn't drank that much that Thursday. I was being given virgin piña coladas. I had no idea. Comes midnight and I'm like, why am I not drunk? And I was like, why? What? I drank like a lot of pina coladas and they were giving me virgin. That's crazy. <laughs> but you had that natural high. I, well, I was that just, high. you were I just super high. happy. Yeah. And yeah. But then the rehearsal dinner, I drank a whole bottle of wine, but like whoever the server put a <laughs> bottle of wine and you I just kept thing. pouring it. And I was like, oh my God, I drank the whole bottle. Oh no. And this, this is the day good. before, the, the day night before. before the yeah. Wedding? So thankfully it was like, nine by the time we were heading back to the hotel so i did give myself like time to hydrate mm -hmm, you know mm -hmm. and kind of you know um, but there's so much adrenaline yeah and probably so the next day you couldn't even sleep like no so i i i take a little gummy can we say that you know yeah, um mm -hmm. and um knocks me out at four something in the morning my brain starts Oh, did we do all oh, the signature? All oh, the posts? Oh my God, uh, the flowers! Yep. Oh, this! And I was like, the "No, worry. shut up, brain, shut up!" So like around <sighs> five, I start seeing the you know little rays of sunshine coming in. I was like, "All right, let me just." I was like, "Let me what? You know, let me get up, and let me see the the sun come out." That was the best thing that could have happened to me. I mean, That's obviously, so other than marrying, yeah. the love of my life. <laughs> but waking up at five because then the sun comes out. Yeah. early in yeah. PR at five o'clock in the morning is already like there. Mm -hmm. Um, and so I open and you saw this, you saw my story. Open I opened my, I, I, yep. you know, I went into the balcony and we're staying at the Caribe Hilton, which is right on. It's like a, uh, and it's like a little Island right there. And yeah. you have the ocean and uh. Condado is right in front of it. And, and you see the little lagoon and I see the sun come up uh. and it was cloudy. It was a little bit cloudy, but also, you know, clear skies. So it was just like, it felt like heaven, like I was entering heaven and angels were like, good, good, buenos dias, you know, <laughs> buenos, it's yes, it's and it had, it gave me a moment of, of, uh, this has nothing to do with, just like with skincare, but like, you know, taking it in and just, and just, you know, I don't know, be grateful. It was right. a moment of, of, of me of, of right. giving thanks to the universe. That's at five o'clock in the morning. My makeup artist doesn't come in till 830. I'm sitting here. I'm like, what am I going to do from 530 oh to my eight? Gosh. So I... It wasn't a mistake, but I shouldn't have done that. I popped another gummy. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what's so crazy? It I doesn't know. even matter what your skin looked like at that point. You were just radiating with yeah. happiness. Yeah. But I was puffy. And I was like, I can't <laughs> do this. I, so I, I, I forced myself back to sleep. Mm. 7.30 comes around. I hear a knock on the door. And I was like, no, I can't wake up yet. I, I know I'm going to be so puffy. I'm not getting enough sleep. And so luckily my makeup artist started with my mom. And I wake up. Because it was a joint uh, uh, room. Yeah. I opened the door. Yeah. Buenos dias. And my makeup party goes, Nana, I was going to be like, oh, no, she's going to do her snap. makeup by herself. Did you he ice? Was, did you I ice did. And then I went, I went, I got ice. I nice. show up with like a bag of ice. And my mom's like, Nana, you okay? I was like, Ma, yeah, this is normal. This is supposed to like, uh, what's it called? Like, um, what's it called? Yeah, the yeah. swelling. Yeah. And even the, the makeup artist was like, yes, yeah, yes, that, yes. Do that. I ice every morning. Yes. Yeah. So it's that's so how good. I started. And then oh, I, I started to feel better. I was like, okay, I'm waking up, I'm waking up. And then I did like my gua sha routine. Yes, the gua sha. I love the yeah. gua sha. And then I did like a mask, like a hydro uh, something mask. And I just like laid on the bed for like 10 minutes. And, and you know, kind of like um, it was a good opportunity to f um, rest and meditate. Meditate. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> She's got the languages. Meditate I know. and till like around 8 30, 9 o'clock. I was like, okay, I'm getting married. You know, I was yeah, like, oh my God, this is what it's it's and, and and think yeah, like I had I was ready. I was but like, you know, it's not like you need to do so much preparation because you're naturally so thank you. beautiful. You have like flawless skin. I mean, there's you nothing, too. There's nothing. You too. Girl. I saw, thank you. Girl. I received that. I received that. But you know, I put a little makeup on this morning. Um, but no, speaking of routine mm -hmm. and like rest is so obviously who rest, I can't, yeah. I, I don't think I could even rest. I know. Like every time I host a party, I, I do that same thing that you do. You wake up way early the day, the day of, and you have 
a list of all the things you need to get done. Yeah. Like, so rest is hydration and rest for mm -hmm, sure mm -hmm. will keep your skin healthy and glowing. But like days like a wedding or like a huge event, it's, it's I mean, terrible. you got, yeah, yeah. And I didn't you, sleep. You did everything. Pri you did I, a lot of prep work. So I, there did, wasn't I did. I did. A lot needed to be done. But I was of. surprised that I got some good sleep because for the bachelorette weekend i didn't sleep at all oh yeah no i was so excited the whole time i didn't want to sleep yeah i had to sleep one time because i got sick <laughs> i drank too much and so yeah. i was like i have to sleep but i didn't want to sleep um but uh but yeah it the the oh. pictures videos oh my gosh i mean i'm sure you'll share I'm i will sure I will. you'll share i will share them a bunch more yes, later i will like i will you know. okay time out real quick is there something interfering with your happiness or preventing you from achieving your goals? Regardless if you have clinical mental health issues like depression or anxiety, or you're just a human living in this crazy world and you're going through a hard time, therapy can give you the tools that you need to approach your life in a very different way. And that's why I'm very excited to tell you about today's sponsor, BetterHelp. BetterHelp's mission is to make therapy affordable and accessible. And this is a very important mission because finding a therapist can be really hard, especially if you're limited to your options in your area. BetterHelp is a platform that makes it easier to find a therapist because it's online, it's remote, and by filling out a few questions, BetterHelp will match you with a professional therapist in just as little as a few days. It is so easy to sign up and match with a professional therapist. There's a link in the description of this episode. It's betterhelp.com slash after we wrap. Clicking that link helps support after we wrap. And you also get 10% off on your first month with BetterHelp. So you can connect with your therapist and see if it helps you. Finding a therapist is a little bit like dating. So if you don't fit with that therapist, which is a common thing in therapy, you can easily switch to a therapist for free without stressing about insurance, who's in your network or anything like that. I personally started using BetterHelp during the pandemic because to say the least, like many, I needed someone to talk to. And I had never talked to a therapist before. And I'm so happy I did because I realized how much I needed it. So I really, really look forward to that weekly meeting. If you are struggling, please consider online therapy with BetterHelp. Click the link in the description or visit the website betterhelp.com slash after we wrap. Thank you again, BetterHelp, for supporting this podcast. Um, but what's your routine? What do you do when, you know, when you routine. wake up in the morning? Okay, so when I am working on set, I try to ice every morning. Uh, there's this silicone cylinder you basically fill with water and you stick it in the freezer and it forms a, a cylinder, oh. like a circular ice okay. ball. And yeah, Nicole yeah, yeah. Caroline created this and I've been using it ever since. I love it. So you, I, you, you're so basically you just, just icing okay. your skin. It, it tightens, tightens your pores. It deep puffs, you know, reduces yeah. inflammation. And almost like an ice bath, but for your face. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Love it. it love it, love it. I Am I super too. strict with it and do oh. it when I'm not shooting? No, because I get lazy. But apparently ice, yeah. icing That's is the, first the, thing is the trick. Yeah. yeah. I have a little thing too that... It's on the fridge. I'll show you. Oh later. yeah, the roly, the, the roly thing. Yeah. Yes, that one. I have one too. I love. I it. don't use it as much, but I yes. So that followed with the gua sha, the, the massaging, sha. Uh -huh. you know, serums, ma massaging. Are we question. This is okay. Genuine question. Mm -hmm. I know we do. You know, we get the Botox. You know, there's no lie about that. And oh wait, no. Do oh, you? No, I I got that once on my chin and I fainted. That's I right, you told me that. on the floor. That's right. Oh my God. Isn't like that crazy? face planted Isn't on the crazy? marble floor. I don't know. I have I have a bad reaction to needles. Mm. I remember getting this local anesthesia on my toe because of a stunt accident. My toe ended up becoming super black and blue. It was, the nail was slowly oh, coming no. off. So in order to uh, remove it completely, I had to go to a podiatrist. Oh, he stuck no. that needle, passed out. Oh my so god. So I don't think I can handle needles. Okay. That Botox experience. Also, I hear if you have a fast metabolism, that should only last for like two months. Yeah. Yeah. So it's like, like if you sweat a lot, work out a yes. lot. Yeah. I know, which is a bummer. So But um I was a little scared on doing the gua sha because like oh, how do you yes. are you supposed I don't even can you do I don't that? Even know. I don't know. I don't can, even know. Can can somebody like Type it, you know, and can you and gua sha? Can you gua sha? Gua, gua sha? Post gua sha. Gua sha. Uh -huh. I don't know. G U A with, with Botox. Yeah, yeah. Oh wait. Oh, 
<laughs> you wash out Botox. Um, Avoid gua sha if you just received injection. If you just received okay. it. Okay, can move the Botox. But like, so what's the time frame? Because I didn't- I would say a, a week, week Okay, after? okay, Maybe two okay. weeks to give yourself some time. Okay. We're not experts on this. Yeah, we don't know. We're not but experts, but we should we should bring a skincare expert Ooh, one we time. should. Because I have so many. One a week. A week, okay. All right, one then week. I'm good. Then I was good. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah. Um, but yeah, then you do the gua sha and yes. then what else? I make sure, okay, so one day I was on the set. I was like a featured background actor for the set of El Cantante with Jennifer Lopez you and Mark Anthony. Do you know they shot that? Yeah. At, you know they shot that at the hotel, Caribe what? Hilton. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Well, they must have shot scenes, Wait, not it? the whole movie. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. yes. Um, part of it the in New York too. The scene where she too. comes in New York, yeah, uh, and obviously in El Viejo San Juan. Yes. But you know the scene where J Lo comes out because they're in the, it's their wedding day and, yes. and 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 Hector is sleeping, and so she goes into his room. That's the Caribe Hilton. Oh. Oh, oh I love God. it. I love it. Oh, so much history. I didn't know this. So I saw a girl pull out an eye cream from her bag and just start applying eye cream. And I was like, I was 20, 19, 20 at the time. I was like, what is she doing? And I love that she was just applying. I'm, I'm such a beauty mm-hmm. product junkie that I'm always interested. Like you, I, I mean, I used to do makeup part time yeah. while I was taking acting classes in New York for my cosmetics. Hey. But it would it was so fascinating just seeing her whip out that product and just apply it. And I said, "What are you doing?" She goes, "Oh, I'm I'm applying eye cream, you know, because you you gotta have your eye." And I, all my teenage like all my, all my teenage, my teenage. all throughout my teens, yeah. I never wore eye cream mm. up until that day I saw her, and then I started implementing eye cream into my routine, morning and night, religiously, like, yeah. I I maybe slept with my makeup on a couple of times and then I read no 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 that's a big no nope. no you don't mm-hmm. want to sleep with your makeup on but I my part of my routine is putting that eye cream yeah and yes. then it wasn't until recently that I put my eye cream here in the eleven oh. and right here on your face uh, your your smile lines I didn't know that and all around the eye yeah wow. yeah you see love a good eye cream and then I like to switch I, I don't like I I'm not I don't like to stay married to one product mm-hmm. line mm-hmm. i like to switch it up especially with the the weather you know yeah. how the weather changes every yeah. year you want to switch up and i think your skin kind of grows too so you have to like also i think i'm not sure if, if this is true let's look this up but it, it, i think your skin changes every seven years Ooh, gosh. i heard something like that yeah every seven years i think yeah. your skin changes um i definitely noticed a difference from my 20s to my 30s like i this i have a, a, a sunspot mm. from driving everything th- what 30, 30 day. day okay cycle oh, oh wow. gosh that's one thing i think once once i've reached my early to mid 30s i had i had a difficult time embracing the change yeah. Like you would see the changes in your neck. You would mm. see the changes in the elasticity and, mm. all, you know, that plump. You you uh, you look at pictures when you were in your 20s and you're full. You've got full cheeks. You, that's why they call it a baby face. But you've you have all this collagen. And then over time with sun damage, you lose all of it and you lose the collagen production. So then you're you know, you've got these wrinkles, you've got these sunspots, you've got the chicken neck is what I like to call it. And whoa, this? being in the, yep, exactly that. <laughs> also tech that. neck, you have tech neck, you're on your What's phone. The, oh, the and you, you're neck? creating these lines from looking down on your phone. So oh. I'm always like, oh, it's such a fucking I'm always pain in the ass. Like, but like being actresses, right? Being in this yeah. industry, which relies heavily on our physical appearance. Mm-hmm. You're like, damn. When a man ages, they're sexy. And when women age, we're old. We're, I mean, okay, obviously now right. that this yeah. that's changed, right? Yes. Like Michelle Yeoh winning that Oscar when she said, I, I am at my, pri- there is no age limit. Mm-hmm. Women, you are in your prime regardless yes. what age you are. God, that speech was. And um, yeah, you sort of embrace it listen don't get me wrong i'm all about if you want to do a little mm-hmm. a little inject a little filler a little what, whatever i mean up until you start changing the way you right. look yeah like do what makes you feel good yeah. um nothing against it but like also 
embracing, embracing that change, the age and, and knowing that like you're, it's, it's, it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. And, and, and a lot of that beauty comes within. Well, we'll talk about inner beauty in a second. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> but you know, even with social media and like what, what beauty standards have, <sighs> Okay, like let's let's talk about let's talk about that. I feel like let it out. Let it I out. feel like there's this sort of false acceptance to 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 the way you look because yeah. of filters. It's really oh yeah, sort of yeah. changed our our the way we we receive beauty and mm-hmm. perceive it, right? Mm-hmm. And sometimes I don't want the edit. I don't want the filtered look because I'm like that's not that's not me. It makes me look beautiful and and feel pretty in the moment but like it's gotten a little overboard and now to the point where every a lot of women are starting to look like those filters in real life Mm -hmm. um so yeah it's like you don't want to judge them either because you know what it feels like right and then also you're it's a weird spot because like you know that you want to always look your best and Mm -hmm. feel your best and at the same time, it's like, you don't have to. Right. Right. That does not, that does not define your worth. Mm-hmm. Or, and, and, and yeah, like I remember, I, uh, was it a, a filter on TikTok or something like that that made you like with makeup yes. or something? And I remember doing the the filter thing and I was like, whoa, I, I like, I personally don't like taking selfies. I just don't like. You don't? I, I don't know. I just don't like the shape of my face. You see what we're really? Yeah, I just I never. You don't seem like you don't like taking selfies. I don't. You you always have this like big smile. I just don't know. I don't know about what it is about selfies. But when I saw that filter, I was like, oh yeah, I'll take selfies. And then I'm like, pendeja, that's not you. And then you know what I mean? Like it was a weird, yeah. And then um, really, I never knew that about you. Oh well, I I had something else I wanted to say, and it left my brain. It's okay. It'll come back. Always. (laughs) It'll come back. It'll come back. But like, yeah, I mean, talk about being pressured to to look a certain way or yeah. to stay young, especially in Hollywood. Oof. Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah. It's, it's, it's oh, wait. weird. Uh-huh. To, uh, to go back to part of the routine, a satin pillow has become my yes, best friend. Yes, I Don't have it. Don't get any dirty mm. ideas. A satin <laughs> pillow is amazing yes. for your face and your hair. And your hair, yeah. It um it keeps you moisturized. It uh you know obviously those other fabrics and materials you mm-hmm. know like the cotton it's it's not the best for your skin. Yeah. Um, but the satin does help with preventing wrinkles and and. And keeping even the moisture in your hair. Shane loves it too. Oh yeah, he Shane uses his a satin, satin pillow. pillow. Yeah, it's okay, <laughs> but also it helps keep the products that you put on your face. Oh really? Yeah, at night it Look helps. That. Uh, it helps some. Um, I didn't even know that. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Cool. Um, but I mean, we could go. We could go. Uh, this. Yeah. This. This conversation. I mean, bottom line, there's so many, like things about beauty that every day you're discovering a new brand a, a new i don't know a new technique, um, technique yeah yeah something like this the new trend itself. yeah and so you're always trying to you know stay up to date mm-hmm. and and I, I like i said i don't know much about it but i'm learning as i but go but you're great as long as you have a routine and you stick yeah. to it you you cleanse you tone you moisturize you do your lasers yeah. and your and your facials yeah. and i guess i guess i do know about it i and just don't know in the sunscreen and the sunscreen yes. and the which sunscreen. i just learned the other day that you have to put like almost like two lines on your finger that's how much you should put oh really it was like so i don't know well TikTok yeah you want to you want to uh don't forget the tops of your ears the and your ears? neck and your neck and your decolletage yeah your decolletage because yeah. oh um, and your the, hand, I always hands, put moisturizer that I already hands, have some, yeah. some sunspots, but your hands and your and your neck, chest area are yeah. the first signs of aging. You want to do whatever you you can to like you know st- take care of yourself, right? It, it's so much, right? It's so much. It's so it's a lot. It's, it's a, a lot. lot. Um, yeah. but to I mean, look at the end of the day, yes, we're talking about skincare, but we also forget that that we're you know, there's inner beauty. 
Oh, yeah. And that inner beauty. That's the most your, important. Your character, what you do, how you treat people, that sh- that makes your outer beauty so much more mm-hmm. beautiful. Mm-hmm. Um, and I love you I can love be You can be meeting. gorgeous. Yes. You can have the most beautiful skin, the perfect body. But you've got a nasty heart. Yeah. But if you got a nasty heart, literally, and a nasty soul, it's like and, you, you, and you exude that type of negative energy. It takes it all away. Yes. No, thank you. <laughs> no, no thank gracia. you no thank Go you away. yeah if you were to be trapped on an island with oh no with five skincare products damn five i got okay five? find three 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 <laughs> what what would they be um i'm taking a long pause here uh uh sunscreen mm. eye cream oh and and the gua sha. <laughs> oh yes, I like that. Because then that'll that'll keep my yeah collagen. I think mine would be um, sunscreen, mm-hmm. an exfoliant of some oh, kind, just to yeah, yeah, to remove yeah. that dead skin. Yeah. And then obviously, um, more. So did I say sunscreen? Did I say unless, sunscreen? Yeah, unless it's a moisture a sunscreen with moisturizing, then you get two in yeah, one. Yeah, you know what? Hey. I take that back. Okay, so my three would be. An exfoliant. Well, you know what? No, because the sand the is an sand. exfoliant. The sand is the exfoliant. So my first, my first ingredient would be would be sunscreen, specifically yeah. Ulta MD, because I'm obsessed with it. Anything with <laughs> zinc oxide, okay, is great for your skin. You didn't even know that. Um, I would do, I would do an eye cream. Yeah, I'm, I'm with you on the eye cream because yeah, you don't want the gallitos, you know. And then you know what? I have to say any kind of lip conditioner. Oh, uh, you do take good any, care of your lips. Any kind of lip moisturizer can be having those, yeah, those, you those do cracked, have, chapped you see, lips. I'm not good at that. I see your lips and I'm like, damn, girl, <laughs> come here. I'm, I, in my, <laughs> uh, in my makeup drawer, there's like, I mean, I used to work for Mac. Yeah. So I have yeah. lip liners and lipsticks and lip glosses and lip stains and lip, so many products. It's crazy. So I'm always, yeah. even in, my treadmill i have a little oh, lip fun. conditioning thing because i don't know why oh, but i have to have chapstick on when i work out it's a weird i need to i need and to, before bed need to do, oh nice mask lip mask before yeah. bed Ooh, i think i think juicy, i put juicy. i put um what's it called chapstick the other night because you were like your lips are dry i was like okay again i was like oh <gasps> You know, if your partner's like your lips are dry, dang. I know, I know. But hey, start licking I, them. Just I know. Start licking you. That means you ain't kissing them enough. Oh, that's a lyric from a Shakira song, but in Spanish, obviously. Is um, that in her new song? No, not her new song, but there's oh, one of their, her songs. That's nice. I like it. Um, Sexual. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, but anyways, I I I I can't. I I have to give a shout out to our. Our abuelas, our tias, our madres, because they're the ones that taught us about right. beauty. And I've never seen my mother leave the house without lipstick. And then I saw my my aunt, my the the OG actress Titi Mili, which oh, I, I um, Mili Ortiz, Mili Ortiz, and she was like, I don't know, I can't leave the house with a pair of earrings or, or like Dude, my eyelashes. Till this and day, I, mm-hmm. my grandmother will not leave the house unless her eyebrows are done. She has eyeshadow. I mean, lipstick. I'm talking about orange yeah. lipstick. She will paint that orange <laughs> lipstick on and go to the grocery store and that's with it. a just, full face. Just to the grocery and store. And her hair is done. Yes. Yeah. So thank If you. my grandmother were to see me right now going to the grocery store looking like this. Oh, forget it. Forget Nina. it. I know. It's so cra- It's so I interesting. I know. How appearance shout, is. Shout out to our Yeah, yeah shout our out to the, the Latin, Latin jeans, yeah. the Latin is satin, the, 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 that olive Thank Olive you for the jeans, skin mommy. tone. I know, um, girl. This was fun. We are so excited to um, to wrap this episode up. Yeah, I and hope that I I continue to f- to find new you products. Will. No, you will, and and learn. I'll just new share things. them with you. Just anything from now on. Anything new that you buy, you sent, you share with me. Like, okay, I just bought this. I just bought this. Um, so to wrap up this episode, let us know what you think. Any yes. comments, questions? Maybe you, maybe if we you can have do any like tips a or advice. You know, do, we can we, one episode. We can do like an unpackaging of of. Oh my god, that would be just amazing. Try it as, and trying as, new stuff. Yeah, I mean, that shout out fun. again to Doctor Gross. That would Thank be you so fun. Much. Yes, let's um, let's Wait, put them back yours. on. Oh, Shane took mine away. All right, oh. it's okay. All right, well. <laughs> oh, here it is. 
Okay, hold on. I'm we're getting gonna, a head we're start. We're going to finish the episode the same way we started it. Obviously, right. you have to do this like with well, you no do it makeup, makeup on, but Obviously, you know what? It doesn't hurt. Right way. But it doesn't hurt. Okay, good night. <sighs> good night.